Hi and welcome students. In this Microsoft PowerPoint 2016 tutorial, I'm going to show you how to adapt presentations for different audiences. Let's get started. So let's say that I have a presentation here, and this one is eight slides long, but today I'm giving a presentation to the managers, and maybe all of the slides aren't relevant to the managers. I'm going to show you how to create a custom slideshow. So right here is the slideshow tab. Make sure that you have that one selected. And then if you go right over here to the start slideshow group, you're going to see this button custom slideshow and this allows you to show only the slides that you choose this is a great way to shorten the presentation or tailor it for different audiences let's click on that and then go right here to custom shows and if you click on this it'll open up the custom shows dialog box this dialog box only has one button available right now because I do not have any current shows so if I go right here to new I can then name my sh my current or custom slideshow right here in the define custom show dialog box. If I highlight this, I could then call this one managers so that I know that this is the presentation that is tailored to the managers. And then I could go right down here and select the slides that I'm interested in showing for the presentation. Let's say that I want slide one, slide two, slide four, slide seven, and slide eight. Notice that I can choose just the slides that I'm interested in and then click the add button. Everything that has a checkbox over here will then be added as soon as I click on that and you'll see all of the slides uh, that I had checked go right over here. And so now that they're in this custom show to the right side I click OK. That'll take me back here and now I see that managers is available here. Now let's learn how to actually show the managers slideshow. So I'm going to go right here to close and I'll see that in the slideshow tab, there's a setup group right here. All right, so within this uh, setup group, I could actually set up my slideshow to default to the manager slideshow. And the way that I'm going to do that right is right here called setup slideshow. And if I click this, then I could go down here and it says show slides, and I go right here to custom show, and I could choose managers, and then I click OK. And now if I start my presentation. I should see slide one, slide two, slide, I think it was four that we chose, slide seven, and slide eight. So let's go ahead and start our slideshow from the beginning in the start slideshow group. We see slide one, we see slide two, there's slide four, there's slide seven, and there's slide eight. So this is a great way to show just the custom slideshow. You could also go right over here to custom slideshow button and click on managers and that will select just the managers slideshow. Remember you could always go back and change your default slideshow by going right here to set up slideshow and changing this back to all and that'll uh, default it back to all of our slides so that now if I go to from beginning now we'll see all of the slides that are listed in our presentation. Okay, and so that's how we change that. Next thing that I'm going to show you how to do is how to edit a custom slideshow. And the way that we do that is we go to the slideshow tab over here to the start slideshow group and we click on the custom slideshow button. And if you click down here on custom shows, you'll see that it opens back up the custom shows dialog box. I select the show that I'm interested in editing, and now I have a few other options over here that were not previously here, like edit, remove, or copy. I'm going to choose edit. And now let's say that slide 8, which was a blank slide, I want to get rid of that from this area. I click on slide 8, and then I go right here to remove, and that removes it from this slideshow. Keep in mind that it doesn't remove it from the actual presentation, which is over here on the left side, but it does remove it from the custom slideshow. Then I click OK and there we go. Finally, if you want to delete a custom slideshow, you would click right there on remove. And I click close, and now we have our custom slideshow all set. So hopefully this video has taught you a little bit more about how to adapt your presentations to different audiences, how to set up a default slideshow as well as a custom slideshow inside of uh, PowerPoint, and also how to edit your custom slideshows. If this video has been helpful for you, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video and have a great rest of your day.